All winter I've dreamt of this moment and it's finally here. Taking the boat out of storage and launching for the first time is a moment filled with optimism. I can't help but to feel inspired by the vibrant young forest as temperatures rise, birds sing, and flowers bloom. The journey and adventures of a new season on the open waters of the Great Lakes has begun and I cannot wait to see what's in store. So the goal of day one was to just shake the dust off. This was our shakedown trip. First time I've had the boat on the lake this year, so we just wanted to work out all the kinks. I got up early in the morning, got the boat ready, and headed south to a port that I've never fished out of before. Once I got down there, I got checked into the hotel, met up with my buddy Mike, and we were headed out for an evening of fishing. Woohoo! What do we have in here? Oh my gosh! Have some new tasty treats. I would have to say my level of excitement right now is at about a 12. I have been waiting all year to get out here and chase some spring kings and this is the first time we've had this old girl on the water this year and I am so excited guys. We're gonna be shaking the dust off everything, knocking off the cobwebs and hopefully Finding some big spring kings, baby. Does this thing look absolutely fantastic? You cannot tell me a big king's not gonna slap that thing. See if the old girl's grouchy or not. Get our graphs on. Okay. Oh, right away. guys we motored quite a ways north we got quite the north a little north chop going on right now and we are just gonna ride these waves all the way home tonight we're gonna get our kicker in the water here get that baby warming up okay guys we are set up and fishing we're gonna get our lines deployed here we're gonna put this downrigger out we're gonna get this downrigger out first 45-ish, that'll work. We'll go with 45. That seems like a lucky number. All right, number one is in the water. We got Kevin's girlfriend, the old standard flasher that seems to always catch fish. Okay, so we got him going out. We're gonna put him in the rod holder and we're gonna let him out slowly. We're gonna get our eight color going on here. We're gonna run a little bit of everything out here. So we're gonna have two downriggers. We're gonna have two divers, one diver on each side, and we're gonna have our planer boards out. Looks good. Oh, 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 oh baby, that just feels right. Oh, that feels good. It's so nice to be back out here. Tied in my coat, bouncing time. Dipsy's just ripping, <laughs> fumbling, phones going flying, keys fall out of your pocket. Oh, we got, we, yep, we're marking, we guys. Movement. Yep, we're moving. So check this out here. That is a mark right there. That's a fish, and that's a little bit of bait around it. So we are in the area. 
Oh, fish, fish. Four, top four. There we go, baby. First bite of the night. Here we go. Okay, Michael, clear. Ooh. Oh, yeah, nice little scrapper king. Oh. <laughs> there we go. Nice job, Mike. Rigger. Got him. Got him, baby. Got him. Oh, there we go. There we go. Mike, I'll go on to you, bud. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, -hoo -hoo -hoo! <laughs> here we go. We're fishing now, baby. We are on some fish and the wind's laying down. It looks like it's gonna be an awesome evening out here. We're gonna try to keep his head right on the surface here. I'm gonna ski him right to you, Mike. Nice net job. Nice! All right! Beautiful net job. Nice Good job. Man, these hooks on these rapture flies just absolutely stick these fish. This treble hook was just burying this thing. Okay, we got line coming everywhere around this fish. What a beautiful king to start our evening, guys. Mike just caught a nice one and we just put this nice, looks like a small adult in the box. So what a way to start the day. That was on a flasher fly way down deep. Some of these fish are just bunkered way down deep and Mike's fish was up high at about 40 feet. Beautiful. We got two in the box. <laughs> okay, we're gonna make sure our bait is all untwisted. Everything looks great, okay. Oh, there we go. Yep. We got him, baby. Underneath. 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 We're changing. We're in the middle of a switch up that bait hadn't been out there five minutes. He's surfing on the top, guys. We've had a little bit of a lull here. The sun is going down, and we got fish on. Yep. He came off. Yeah. Rad. He gone. He gone. Oh well, we'll get another one. Rigger, 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 rigger. There we go, baby. Oh, he's going underneath. He's going underneath. Oh, we got a screamer. We got a screamer. All right. That's a better fish there. Oh. There we go, baby. We have been changing things up, guys. Our spread wasn't working. We just started fixing things and weaving in and out. So we got something going here. I think we should be good to put that out if you want, Mike. <laughs> we got a ripper. I think he's far enough over though we could sneak that out. Oh my gosh, this thing is just going nuts. Gosh, right in the middle of our change up. What a beautiful afternoon, guys. The sun is just setting, it made a little appearance here. We got some good kings on, baby, they're biting. I've been waiting all winter for this. Been thinking about this all winter, waiting for this moment right now. <laughs> this is so awesome. Fish is just going crazy right now. Coming at me, coming at me. Oh shoot, bro. Okay, we got a predicament, guys. Okay, I think, how does this go? I think we gotta bring them both in at the same time, okay? I think we gotta bring them both in at the same time. Okay, I'm just gonna walk them back, Mike. I can't go really go back 
too much more, bro. Oh, what a net job. What a net job, bro. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> great job, man. What an awesome time. Mike made a heck of a net, net scoop on that one. <laughs> the fish got into our high diver and the line got underneath the swivel. But we got him in the boat and we are going to get another one. Oh, 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 kink, bro. Kink, bro. We got a kink. Oh my gosh. It's do or die time. It's do or die time. Come on, 40 pound. Hold up, baby. <laughs> it's, it's a rodeo. We're wrestling this one. <laughs> oh, there he goes again. Oh. Oh, he's getting near the kink. He's getting near the kink. I guess he's getting near the kink. He's getting near the kink. Oh, this is a good fish. Oh, oh, he's at the kink. He's at the kink. Okay, I'm gonna pull back. He's at the kink. Guys, there's so much pressure in here. This fish is just going nuts. Oh my gosh, he's getting near the kink again. He's Mike, there is a giant kink in this line. I literally can't pull it out. Look at this. Just do on this wire line. This fish is just going bananas, man. This is going nuts. Whew. My arm's sore. This fish has just been ripping my arm apart. <laughs> oh man. Gosh. The wire's crazy. Oh, rigger, 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 rigger. I got you, I got you. <laughs> oh my gosh, here we go. 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 Oh, rigger, rigger, rigger. <laughs> oh, here we go, guys. Here we go, here we go. He's on the fire, fire fish, fire fish. Spider, spider, spider. I can feel him. He's vibrating. I'm gonna catch up to him. He's gonna go bananas. There he is, there he is. There he is. Oh shoot. Oh, this, this one's ripping too, man. Okay, Mike, I'm gonna try to get you, bro. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I can't tell, guys. He's, he's, no, he came off. He's gone, oh no. Project for a rainy day here. Come and blow through lines have ever looked like this. <laughs> what do we got, a laker? Yep. Okay, that's okay. All right, I'm gonna hit it in the net, bro. Grab that, the got the net. We're gonna step back. Okay, we got another fish for you to do. Oh, 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 finally. What? Yep. Okay, I need help. Oh my gosh. I got this side. Got it. Gosh, this net's huge. <laughs> Mike, you kinda got a predicament here, brother. Yep, I'm coming. You got a predicament too, man. <laughs> man. Got him, baby. Nice, Mike. Nice. Well, guys, we got redemption. Oh, it's a dandy. Come on, King. <laughs> That's a dandy. We got redemption, baby. Okay. That was awesome, guys. We had a heck of a bite there. We ended up getting a few in the boat, but they tore us apart, really. That's what you gotta love this time of year. The fish just go absolutely insane. But mission accomplished. We found some fish. We kicked the dust off the boat. Broke her in for the first time this year. Now, tomorrow morning, we're gonna set right up here, right on top of these fish, and hit them hard. So we're gonna head back in, get some sleep. We'll see you guys first thing in the morning. How was that? Oh, diver, 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 oh, diver. Oh, diver, diver, baby. <laughs> here we go, here we go. We were just doing the outro. And we're hooked up, baby, we're hooked up. Hey, where you, where you think it's... Oh my gosh. Oh! Oh, it's a good one. It's a good one, baby. Oh, get him, get him. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Take your time, take your time. Got him, bro, got him. We got him. <laughs> Last ride in the water, we got him, baby. <laughs> oh, it's the biggest one of the night, too. It is the biggest one of the night. I'm all tangled up in the motor. 
Day one was a total success. The boat ran smoothly, we worked out a few minor kinks in the gear and in the boat, and were even able to find some fish. We made it back to port safely, we cleaned our fish, ate a late dinner, and got right to sleep. We were super excited to hit the water bright and early in the morning. That work, Mike? We got in here, guys, made it back safe. I'm gonna go get some fish cleaned up here. What an awesome evening we had. Wow, that was absolutely amazing. Great first trip of the year. And that's a wrap. And the games have begun. <laughs> fish, 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 top board, top board, top board, baby. <laughs> Things get <getting> ripped. <laughs> double up, double up. We got some screamage over there, Mike. Yeah. <laughs> Here we go, guys. We got them on this morning. <laughs> This is a big fish! Oh, 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 look at that! We're double fishing! Oh my gosh, guys, this is a big fish. This is a big one. This is a big one. <laughs> we're, gonna do, we're double fishing! <laughs> holy cow, holy cow, holy cow. I gotta get it. Yeah, sure. Yes, let's do that. Okay. <laughs> we gotta bore it up in the tree with a fish on. <laughs> We got a fish out here. Mike's got a fish on the other rigger. All right, guys. <laughs> here the games have begun. Right. Okay, I gotta go under you, Mike. Yep. Okay. Holy cow. Oh, diver, diver. Oh, diver, diver, right here. Go, diver. Oh, <laughs> oh my gosh, four fish shot. We got a quad. It's a quad. <laughs> Oh, we're jacking them. Okay, we're gonna put this diver in the holder. Oh, 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 oh. The ready as I'm ever gonna be. Fish number one. Hold on, bro. Got him. Nice kick. Grab a grab, grab a rod. Try that diver rod. Does not want to quit. He wants to live, Mike. We'll pick his head up. Oh, there we go, baby. There we go. There we go. Beautiful. Oh. Got him. Nice job, Mike. Three of the four guys. We got three of the four, baby. 
Alright, I got him. Got it? Yup. Slow diver. I got this rod. <laughs> got him. Got him. Coming in. Coming in, baby. <laughs> oh my gosh. Holy crap. Oh. Wow. Unbelievable. Job to you too, brother. Wow. Another one down. Another one down, man. What an epic morning. Woo. Right, you ready to make money moves? Get yeah. the fish out, put it in there. We're gonna run back and okay. yep. control back. So what we're gonna do, guys, is we're gonna motor back up to where we started this morning and go back through all those fish again. It's pretty choppy out right now and there's a lot of current, so we're just gonna motor through these waves up a couple miles, do that south troll with the waves, back through those fish, and see if we can finish out our limit here. Oh my god! And we're in them again! Oh! Ho, ho, ho. Great job. Oh, that's another pig. Another pig. Wow. That's a pretty one. I'm a cinnamon roll. Breakfast is served. Well, day two was a total success as well. We had about as much action as we could handle, especially with the big waves that we had. So we made it back into port safe and just enjoyed the rest of the day. We had a great lunch and then Mike headed out late that afternoon and I was gonna meet up with my good friend Jim and we were gonna get back out after those kings. But as I was sitting in the hotel room late that evening, I thought, Let's take the drone and go capture some of the scenery that this area has to offer as I've never personally experienced it as well and I was really glad I did because I was able to get some awesome shots.
got the grill. Jim's got the grill this morning, guys. We're gonna have a nice lunch out on the boat today. It is a beautiful morning. You got a cooler? Yep, cooler goodies. Cooler goodies. What a beautiful morning, hey Jim? Oh, sure. It's gonna be an awesome day. I can take that. Ready to go get them, Jim? Yes, sir. All right. Got a few boats out here today, hey? We ready for takeoff? We're ready for takeoff. Let's go get them, guys. Okay guys, so we're just getting our downriggers out here this morning. First thing, we're gonna run a little bit of everything out here today. We're gonna run two downriggers, two dipsies, and two planer boards, I think. So we're gonna mix it up until we get something dialed in here. Drop them down to the dips. Oh yeah, that's a fish. We are marking. We gotta get these lines out. We gotta get them out there. They know they don't stand a chance. These fish. No way. <laughs> they don't stand a chance. Yep. <laughs> okay, come and get it. Come and get it. How many, um, how many? Low diver, low diver. <laughs> Double on some kings. What a beautiful sunrise, guys. Right when I took that picture. Right when you're getting a picture. We got them going. Doubled up on our divers. What a beautiful sunrise. Just an absolutely gorgeous morning. Lake is flat, calm. And we got some big kings on. Oh no. I just lost mine. No. Oh, I lost them, guys. Oh, rigger, 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 Jim. Rigger. Who's there? Who's there? Who's there? Who's there? Slider fish, slider fish. Oh, 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 oh. There we go. Yeah, oh, I gotta. Okay, I'm gonna have to move. Oh my gosh, this fish is going crazy. Here we go. Um, you're probably okay there. My fish, oh look at him, he's streaking out the surface. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. He's coming out the surface. Yeah. Step back. Okay. Oh, it's a nice one. Oh, got him, Jim. Nice job, buddy. Nice one. Nice. Nice job, buddy. Oh, high diver, high diver, high diver, high diver. Yeah, yeah. Get this fish in here. Yeah. This is diving. No, you got one on yours too. Oh, got him, baby. <laughs> one arm. Snag. Oh, fish, 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 fish. Top board. Oh, oh, oh. that's that rod. <laughs> All right, guys. Hooked up on a board. That's an eight color lead core set up there. 
We're just getting our lead cores out. I was actually just putting our second lead core out. We pulled this other high diver over here and uh, we're just stealthying things up a bit. If our boards get real hot, we might even go to more boards. Dancing on it. <laughs> He's not too impressed yet. No. He didn't. He finally realized he took. <laughs> Awesome gem. What a beautiful king, guys. I just love how silver and fresh, chrome and feisty these kings are this time of year. Beautiful fish, Jim. Look how fat that thing is. That is just a pure butterball. Got him on a planer board. Just beautiful day out here. You couldn't ask for a nicer day. Calm. Probably a dozen other boats out and things here, but we've just been doing our own thing and landing some fish. Oh, got one? Got one going. <laughs> yep. <laughs> got one going. Got one on the diver. All right. About well, time a diver worked again. We'll credit that to the apple turnover. Yeah, we broke the seal and hooked the fish. <laughs> Usually how it works. You break out the food, get something going, that's when the fish start biting. This is like the same one we hooked on our first one. Yep. This is a nice two year old king here, guys. That's going to be a great, great eater. Nice, Jim. There we go, top board, top board, top board. Top board, get the rip. <laughs> That's a big fish, Jim. Oh, it's running, Jim, let him run, let him run. Okay, I'm gonna come help you. Oh, diver, 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 diver. Diver, oh my gosh. Got him? Got him. about how he was just a cute little eating size and took it personally. Nice job, Jim. Oh, diver, diver, diver! Oh, 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 oh. There we go, baby! <laughs> Doubled up! Jim's got one on, Jim's got one on the board! Oh, 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 oh. Here we go. Here we go, mid-morning bite. Jim, I'm gonna slide underneath you real quick. Got a double going, baby! <laughs> Mid-morning bite, guys. Is that the yeah. way back there, Yep, you're the farthest board back, yeah. yep. We got one fish on a deep wire diver, back 300. So that bait's down in that 90 foot range. And Jim's got one on an eight collar, so the fish is just spread out a little bit everywhere right now. <laughs> He's going under the boat. Oh, we got him. We got him, Jim. <laughs> that's, oh, that's a dandy. All right, guys. We got him. Oh, a nice fish, too, hey? Great job. <laughs> Great job. Yeah, we got some good coverage too, didn't you? Oh yeah. Heck yeah, we did. This is a nice wild fish. You guys can tell by the adipose fin there. It's great to see these really nice, healthy, wild fish and all the good natural reproducing we have going on. So just an awesome time out here. Jim and I, Jim and I have just had a fantastic morning and rigor, rigor, rigor. Oh my God. Right when we're just doing our little how-to, 
the downrigger got bit. This was fish was on the slider, so this is another great trick that I'm going to show you guys. It'll allow you to have more baits off your downrigger, and you can run more more baits, get more baits in the water here. So I'm going to show you this right after we get this fish in the boat. This feels like probably a two-year-old king. Another, not a monster, but a good little eater. It looks like. Oh, oh, oh. Back here. Yeah. Right there. Come see him right there. Nice net job, Jim. Nice net job. Nice two-year-old king, it looks like, guys. That was on an orange spoon, so we've just been mixing up colors. Really been catching fish on a lot of different colors, but we're just trying to put a variety out there as best as we can. Now, when we're talking bait selection for early season like this, I like to run spoons and flasher flies are my favorite. Sometimes I will run meat rigs, but we're running mostly spoons and flasher flies. On our high lines off our lead cores, we're running spoons off those, then off our deep downriggers and our divers, we're running flasher flies off those and we're getting them deep. We've caught nice big mature kings this morning on both high lines, 20 feet below the surface, and we've caught them 110 feet down. So the fish are just spread throughout the water column. We're just spreading our lines out, putting good stuff out and we're just driving until we find schools of fish. So now I'm going to break down a lot of the gear that we're running here today guys. So on our planer board setups here we have an Okuma convector reel. This is a 55L convector reel. These are great reels for planer boards because it's a large spool so you can fit on a lot of line. We have 300 yards of 50 pound test power pro backing. You want to make sure to run a heavy backing and make sure to at least have 200 yards on because if you're getting inside of that you're sending these boards way out there if you have a big fish on it just makes you nervous so I like to make sure I at least have 200 but I go 300 yards back just to be sure now we have an eight color lead core setup coming off of our braid here out to a planer board now we have eight colors of lead core we could even run up to like a 350 400 copper I run on these convector reels and now for our rod we just have an Okuma classic pro this is a lake trolling rod and this is a great rod for a planer board this is all you need for a planer board rod now for our downriggers we have Okuma cold water reels these are great reels for downriggers you can spool on a lot of line I spool on about 300 yards of 25 pound test mono and as the season goes on and we start using more paddles and meat rigs I'll even bump up to 30 and now we're gonna go over to our divers here guys so for our divers this is an Okuma Big Lake Tournament Series wire line rod. You can see the guides are made for wire line and the twilly tip on the end that's made for wire line. Now this reel here, this is also an Okuma cold water reel, but this reel is made for wire line. You just want to make sure when you're running wire divers that you have a reel that's designated for wire line. So this is a great setup here. I love this rod. The rod's lightweight. Finding a good dipsy rod can be tricky because you have to have a rod with a good backbone, but you want to feel those fish thumping as well. So this rod here, it's really lightweight. I love it. it works perfect. And uh, we're going to throw it back in the rod holder and see if it'll get bit. Okay guys, I'm going to show you the slider trick here. So we have about a 75 foot leader off of our ball. When it's mid morning like this, I like to run a longer leader. First thing in the morning, I'll just run about a 30 foot leader though. Now I'm going to put this down about 15 or 20 feet just for now. I'm going to set it down there for just a second. And now I'm going to grab my slider here. So I have a spoon, it's a Michigan Stinger standard size spoon, and I have a seven foot piece of 20 pound test fluorocarbon with a big swivel connected to it. So this is going to be a free slider. I'm just going to put this in the water. Now I'm going to take this swivel here and I'm going to put it right on my main line. Okay. Now I'm just going to slowly let this down and just let that slide right down my main line. Now this spoon is going to go down about half the distance my downrigger ball is at. So I'm going to put my main downrigger line down to about 110 feet and that spoon's probably going to be in that 50 foot range and this can be a very effective way to catch fish when they're spread all throughout the water column and it gives you that option to have another lure in the water. Okay guys, here we go. Oh Jim. Oh he's going nuts. Oh he's going nuts. Oh he's, he's sharking. Oh we got him baby! Number 10! <laughs> Jim, what a beautiful fish to end the day with our 10 kings. <laughs>
looks like we got off the water at the perfect time because the wind is howling now. It's about 10, 15 mile an hour out of the north, but I don't think there's anything better than getting off the water and having a nice lunch. And Jim has got some steaks going on the grill right now. This is how you take care of your good friends and things after a good day of fishing. We've got 10 salmon out there today. Started about 6.30, got done about noon, so it was just Super day, so I couldn't ask for more. Really appreciate you guys tuning in, and uh, we will see you back here in a couple weeks in our next video. So now we're going to enjoy a nice steak lunch. Hey, Jim.